Hello Virgo, welcome to your reading. My name is Callie. Hopefully you guys are doing all right. So today we're going to be doing a timeless read. For the first spread, we're going to be doing um, what is your current energy, what your current energy holds. And then the second spread, we're gonna do what's coming towards you. Um, like I said, hopefully you guys are doing all right. Go ahead and hit the like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what videos you guys wanna see next. And let's get started with the reading. So Virgo, let's see what's going on in your overall energy. What's going on for Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus? Okay, so we have the Page of Pentacles. So something, so I feel like something is taking, something is taking your time or something, or someone is taking their time with you or something needs time to, to, to move or something needs time to like grow. Something about time here. Or I'm also hearing so you're you're running out of time or you need more time or you need to focus on time. Something about time here. Something about a watch, an Apple watch. Something about a watch. You need to watch the time. 120. Something about something about time. Could be angel numbers because I'm hearing 1111 in my head. Something about time. Could be numerology. Something about time. Let's see. Let me see. Okay. We have the, yeah. Again, the world, you see how the, in the two of, I was about to say the world card, but this is the two of wands. You see how he's holding the world? The world equals time. Something about time here. You need to wait for something. Or you need to be patient. I don't know what this is. Let's click. Let's keep going. Let's clarify. Give me another card, spirit. I feel like you need to wait your wait your time, wait your turn. We have death, and then we have the four cups. So I feel like spirit has ended something for you. I feel like something has ended for you. And it, it, it's leaving you feeling empty, lonely, depressed. It's leaving you feel unmotivated. Like, you know, what, like you're, you feel like, like, okay, this ended for me. What now? Um, I feel like spirit is telling you, you need to wait. Something is coming in for you, but you need to wait. We have the Ace of Swords. Something is coming in for you, but you need to wait give it some time something needs time something either needs time to heal you need time to heal you need to wait I, I, I don't know but i'm hearing you need to wait like things take time you can't rush into things expecting it to work like you need to give something time you need to give something space i feel like someone is saying that to you like you need to give them space if, if you're in a relationship and someone is telling you that you need to give them space, give them space. I, that doesn't mean that this person wants to, you know, not be with you because they don't want to be with you 24-7. They just need their time alone. Stop being so clingy, uh, Virgo. So we have the Queen of Swords in reverse. Yeah. Someone is upset. Okay, so I feel like you could have gotten into an argument with your significant other. Yep, we have the Two of Cups. And then we have the Five of Cups. Okay, so either you got into an argument with your significant other or um, someone who you're really close to. And I feel like you need to give them space. You need to give them time. I feel like right now they don't want to speak to you. They're, they're ignoring you because, you know, all you want to do is complain or... Or this could be the other way around too. All they want to do is complain and you just want space. I just feel like something just needs something that just needs to be something just needs to blow over. I feel like something just needs space. Yeah, five of wands. Look, there was some type of argument here, some type of fight, some type of commotion. And I feel like you need to separate yourself from this situation here. Either you or them or it already happened. It could already happen, too, because the, how these cards are separate. Yeah, we have judgment. I feel like this already happened and I feel like it could be you that it could be you that's like putting like 
more fuel to the fire like you're trying to start another argument i feel like spirit is telling you no or it could be the other person i feel like if it's you that's causing more chaos in this situation i feel like you just need to back off it's if it's the other person then you just need to cut them off cut them out move away from them yeah we have the three of uh three of wands even though it's in the reverse um i feel like it's time for you to focus on other things i'm not sure what is going on or what happened what transpired that led to this argument but i feel like it's time for you to focus on something else focus on your career or focus on you know how to improve your home environment or how to improve your um how to improve yourself like i feel like it's just time for you to focus on yourself that's what i'm hearing there I go. But overall, that's what's going on in your overall energy. We have the Queen of Pentacles in reverse. I feel like something isn't done here. Something isn't done, but I feel like you do need to you do you do need to remove yourself from the situation here for now at least. Okay, so Virgo, let's move on to what's coming towards you. coming towards virgo sun moon rising venus Ooh, the sun happiness see i told you listen don't 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 go trying to don't go trying to create a, a chaos here just just be patient you know give the other person space and then here you go the sun <laughs> but let's see what else is going on for virgo someone could be coming in could be an earth sign we have the queen of wands in reverse um okay so okay so i feel like whatever this argument or this fight or this um this conflict it could be internal conflict as well whatever this conflict is that's going on around you i'm, I'm seeing it being resolved but i feel like you're still unsatisfied or it could be the other person um yeah we have the king of wands i mean the king of swords Someone is not telling the full truth. I feel like someone is hiding how they truly feel. I feel like someone is kind of being the people pleaser in the situation and they're telling they're telling the other party what they want to hear and not what they actually want to say. So I feel like this in return might start another argument between you and your significant other. We have the Ten of Cups. Everything might be fine for now, but like how these cards are set up i feel like something yeah we have the hangman i don't feel like things are going to fully be resolved and i even feel like you feel the same way i don't feel like you feel like things are still i feel like you still feel like i still i feel like you still feel like things are not completely 100 percent yet i don't know why but i'm also hearing that you don't you you don't know where you stand when it comes to this person you don't know where you stand with this person we have the four pentacles in reverse i feel like you're over this relationship here virgo i feel like you're over this situation i feel like you're over this relationship i feel like you're tired of constantly uh being in arguments with this person constantly you know being unhappy in a in a in a situation constantly fighting for something that you feel like is going nowhere i've seen the ten of swords Yeah, we have the page of swords i feel like you don't want to fight for this anymore you don't want to either you don't want to fight for this anymore or you don't want to fight anymore in in general but i feel like it's the it's the first the first thing that that comes to mind for me and then we have the nine of pentacles on the bottom of the deck i do feel like i do feel like i said i do feel like things will 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 I do feel like things will resolve. I do feel like things will resolve in the end. Things will get, things will be resolved in the end. But I, I do still see some type of turmoil, and it's gonna leave you unhappy. It's gonna leave you uncertain. It's gonna leave you feeling stuck. But I am seeing three of cups. This could be spirit, or this could be literal people in your life. I'm seeing people coming in. Um, they're gonna give you some type of advice. I feel like you should listen to these. 
people, these people here. Could be a water sign, could be an earth sign. But yeah, I have, I'm getting you have a very, you have a lot of loving friends around you that are willing to give you advice, and they give you really good advice. So I feel like you should listen to your um your peers, the peers around you. But yeah, I think that I'm gonna leave that. I think I'm gonna leave the reading here for you guys, Virgo. So Virgo, that was your reading. Hopefully you guys enjoyed your read. Um, if you are new, go ahead and hit the like, subscribe, the old subscribe, like, why aren't you subscribed yet if you come back and watch my videos? But anyways, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.